Living with all these multiple diseases has quite literally stolen my life. There isn't a day or even a moment when I'm not in pain. This kind of disease is absolutely a disgrace. It is a national epidemic. Lyme disease is the leading vector-borne infectious disease in the United States, with potentially more than 500,000 new cases each year. Combine this fact with the escalating number of reported cases worldwide, and the result is a global pandemic. Within the past 10 years or so, uh, 10 to 15 years, the incidence of Lyme disease has almost doubled. To make matters worse, there has been a continuous rise in the overall number of ticks across the globe. We are all one tick bite away from constant debilitating pain, unexplained neurological problems, organ failure, and even death. This illness does disproportionately affect young people, children, and when it does that, it can be devastating, and you know, at a time of their life that's so crucial. For children, Lyme can mean anxiety, isolation, and school avoidance. For adults, Lyme can end relationships and careers. We are all potentially exposed to a disease that has no reliable diagnostic test or cure and is greatly misunderstood and often unacknowledged by the medical community. Global Lyme Alliance is leading the way to change that. We are the only 501c3 with a three-tier admission to conquer Lyme and tick-borne diseases through research, education, and awareness with a major focus on research. GLE's leadership role in identifying possible answers, cultivating and funding the most promising scientists and research initiatives has had the greatest impact on the community and patients. We are not the only ones being impacted. The number of family dogs contracting Lyme disease has doubled over the last five years. This map shows where most Lyme cases are found. However, this vastly understates the true picture. In the veterinary world, vets routinely test pet dogs. Since every dog lives with its human family, the true human incidence map likely looks more like this. Lyme disease is complicated, too complicated to solve by looking at one aspect or one species. Dogs get Lyme too. Hundreds of thousands of dogs suffer horribly from Lyme every year. Global Lyme Alliance is the only Lyme organization that's willing to look at that, help us help dogs, and help people as well. GLA is at the forefront of discovery, innovation, and major scientific advancements. As such, we've become the leading catalyst for change in the Lyme disease world. We're also the first organization to prove that chronic Lyme disease exists and that Lyme disease can often evade antibiotic treatments. Additionally, GLA has been effective at providing the initial funding for today's major Lyme researchers as a venture capitalist would, which has led to significant discoveries. The work that's come out of, of funding from the Global Lyme Alliance is absolutely astonishing. We've been supported by GLA for a number of years, since 2009. You put a top-notch researcher on a project, he wants to solve it. The only limiting factor in our moving forward uh, is resources. The more resources that we have, the faster we'll be able to move and, and bring cures. We are so proud that we provided the initial funding to so many of today's top Lyme researchers. And we're continuing that trend. We're the first ones looking at pediatric Lyme cases, at Alzheimer's, and whether Lyme is a potential cause, and at the gut microbiome to see whether Lyme disease changes that and causes the chronic symptoms that so many Lyme patients are suffering with today. An organization like the Global Lyme Alliance is as strong as the people who participated in it. Doctors need tools to take care of their patients, and without those tools, we can't get them better, and that's not acceptable. By both the patient population and by the scientific community coming hand in hand, we will be able to conquer this disease. Please, join Global Lyme Alliance and our fight to conquer Lyme disease and end the injustice endured by so many.